anything with Adam Cotto. Met him? Like met all. I partied with <laughs> Did you hang out with Kronos? Yeah, I partied with Kronos. He gave me a full liter of blueberry gin to, to drink. And Slayer picked me up in her van, rode me around all crazy to his daughter's parking lot. Wow. It was pretty cool. Because Kronos goes, I'm sick of this shit. And he hands it to me. And I'm like, oh, I'll drink it. And I slam the whole bottle in like 30 seconds. My friend's like, oh my god, Slayer's like people in your van across the street. So he ran across the street and jumped into the van of Slayer. And Slammed the door shut and rolled all crazy through McDonald's parking lot. Um, yeah. Do you like rattlesnakes? Yes, I do. I have uh, a bunch of rattlesnakes <coughs> from when I was a kid in North right. Carolina. We had the eastern uh, timberback rattlesnake there. Uh, you ever get, get bit by one? No. No, never got bit by one. You ever kill one? Yeah. My dad killed a rattlesnake in World War II. I killed it with a, with a stick. Really? Yep. Shit. When I was about eight, I killed one with a stick. Uh, walking, I was walking through the woods, and there was one. They, they could climb up trees, and it was climbing up a tree, and fucking took the stick. Whack, whack. I still have the rattle from that one. Oh, yeah, he bought an express on machine tree so he could rip the, the nightmares in the frog. <laughs> awesome! <laughs> I, I didn't mean originally intend that lyric to be <coughs> exactly about coffee, but it definitely, I will always think about coffee now. Yeah, in the book World Records, you realize like 8,000 telephone numbers or something, you know, so if you do that, I can, well, it took me, it like that box you guys play in six minutes, a different notes, but um, it's like, if I, I don't know, if I can memorize 15 minutes worth, like, uh, 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 <coughs> Did you write this one, Randall? Um, Remorses for the dead? Yep. What did you think that was about? <coughs> I think the dirty lord of the manor surveys his filthy domain. I think it's about house cleaning. It is! You are absolutely right. It's about a house I used to live in called Dirtbag Manor that was completely disgusting. And that house was never, ever, ever, ever clean. We just had mountains of garbage. It's totally about house cleaning. You are absolutely correct. <laughs> You're a genius. We read a book the other day that was written in 1910 that said that there's people who know and people who don't know, and those who know know why they are here and what they are supposed to do. What do you think about that? Yeah, there's. A, yeah, I, I believe that, and I believe that you know, those who know, there's an old saying, those who know don't tell, uh, those who tell don't know. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. it's kind of like all the same. Lines. Do you try, do you try, like, when you're singing, do you try and more be yourself, or do you try and, like, extend your voice into certain areas? I guess the way my voice is now is just part of myself. Ah, uh, yeah, you know? yeah. So, uh, I guess it is just kind of like... That's what I learned. When I try not to extend my voice in any other area than where it would normally go, that it comes out the best and seems yeah. yeah. natural way to do it. <coughs> Alright, um, what is the most fun thing you can think of that you're capable of doing? Uh, <coughs> the most fun thing that I've learned how to do since I was born is play drums. That, that's the answer I'm looking for. I think different people have different creative abilities, you know, yeah. everybody is creative in their own way, it might be that, like Einstein, you're great at uh, physics and math or something, yeah. that to him was creative, you know, that's yeah, what he yeah. did and loved and had a passion for, and you have a passion for playing guitar, yeah. you have a passion for playing drums, but everybody's got their little yeah. special niche in life. That's what Gene Simmons said, he said that, um, that, uh, he likes people like Einstein because where other people, like, rip with their music, that, uh, people like Einstein rip with their minds. So. Exactly. Everybody's got a little special something. You yeah. just gotta find it. You think that Einstein rips? <coughs> sure. Let's talk about depression. Depression? I think depression is the last you ever... thing you ever want to get into because it leads to suicidal thoughts and I think that I think that people should I think that suicide should be the last thing on anyone's mind. Well, I think that uh, 
you know, as you get older, you have all these responsibilities build up on you, you know, and, and there's certain things you have to do. And like, the other day, we found just this, uh, like a kickball, like from a uh, middle school or something. Yeah. And so we grabbed it, and uh, we got a Nerf football too, and just sitting around in the dressing room, like kicking this kickball around. It's like even yeah, th- even though you know what we do for a living is fun, or most people think it's fun. You know, I get to play drums every night. It's fun for me. It's fun for everybody that gets uh, to listen. It's, it's a good time. But there's still a lot of things that, as I get older, I don't think about anymore. I don't do anymore. And kicking that kickball around, throwing it against the wall, and all uh, that stuff. It was just like it kind of like made me think about like when I was a little kid. Right. I think a lot of people grow up and they get all these responsibilities and they become uh-huh. so serious and right. so job oriented or relationship oriented that they forget about themselves and they right. get into a pit that they can't get out of. And I think that's what. Then the you gotta play the drums. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, do yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. You know, create it. And if your job, if you love your job, then that's great. You know, uh, a lot of people go to school and get degrees and then work in something that has nothing to do with yeah. what they ever wanted to do to begin with. And they just get bummed out after a while trying to answer the question yeah. of why, why am I doing this? Why am I here? Yeah, yeah. Have you ever helped Randall clean his house? Have I ever helped him clean his house? No, I haven't. In fact, I stay away from that dude's house as much as possible. What do you think? What was the question I was going to ask? Oh, you rather grow up or stay a kid in your mind? I think having a good balance of both is uh, what makes a happy life. Of, of knowing that you can take care of the things you need to take care of and handle your responsibilities, but at the same time, stay young in your heart and do things that are fun and hang out with good people and just make the most of it. Like I, I said, say doing things that are fun is, uh, is the first priority. You know? Well, I think. Yes, the fun comes after the ability because you can handle your uh, everything that has to happen before you right. can have. How do you think about nature, like wooded areas, like trees and stuff like that? I wanted to get married in the redwood forest. Yeah, I, love that See, I grew up kind of a quarter block away from a forest. It used to be a whole army cooking camp, and now it's a forest. And I grew up hanging out here all my life, and now I take Kate back there. There's like a bridge back there from 1910. And Bridge from 1911, and that's our official cigarette smoking spots. And you know, it used to be old army prison camp, and, and then it was called the Army Barracks. And now this place even you know, was bought into preserving because um, otherwise it wouldn't have been turned into a shopping center. And they had like apple orchards out there, and cherry trees. You know, it's pretty neat to see the birds like have so, so much open space where they can just fly across the sky. And, Know, be themselves or something, you know, all that, you know. I just feel like I kind of told Kate I feel like I kind of own those woods because uh, I spent more time in them than when I 